How's it going guys? My name is Rapolis and I do want to say one thing that I'm a little bit sick so I do apologize for the cough or a sneeze or or something like that. Any idea where we are in relation to the rest of the park? We're not far from the marine exhibit. I know for a fact that the phone there is in working order or at least it was this morning. Did we get there from the tunnels? I believe so. All right then, lead the way. Want to get us out of here as soon as possible. No more science projects, okay? Yep. I agree. I understand. Uh, why aren't you sh uh, Are we going the right way? Okay. Don't worry, Jess. We should be safe in here. Where do all these doors lead? The maintenance corridors. The park's essential systems are in there. Uh, electrical, water, air conditioning, you know, that sort of thing. The tunnels on this side are for transporting animals, personnel, and food. Oh, That's like why that. they're so big. They are separate from the maintenance side to prevent accidents. Oh, these are like um, VIP. Um, imagine the park visitors are, are upstairs and we're like the VIP. Like, where you're transferring new dinosaurs and just, ah, so cool. Okay, um... Well, as long as we're getting to know one another, how is it that Dr. Wu became chief geneticist over you? That's an easy one. Frogs. You're saying frogs kept you from getting promoted? Specifically, their DNA. Before we could clone any dinosaurs, we had to decide how to fill in the gaps in the DNA sequences we found. I remember this from the tour. You found dino blood inside mosquito fossils, right? That's right. I wanted a complete prehistoric genome, cross-referencing all of the DNA found in the various amber samples. It would have been safer, but would have taken time the board of directors didn't want to spend. Well, even Dr. Hammond's spare-no-expense philosophy has limits, I guess. Exactly. Uh. Henry, Dr. Wu, proposed using frog DNA to fill in the gaps. It was risky. We still don't know all of the effects. But it was a solution, and a fast one at that. So Henry became chief geneticist, and I took to the field. Took to the field, yeah. Are we going the right way? Are you sure we shouldn't head to the visitor center, Dr. Sorkin? InGen is bound to start there when they don't hear from the rescue team. These tunnels don't run all the way to the visitor center, and I don't know about you, but I'd rather not risk any more overland travel. Okay. Good point. Has anyone seen my cigarettes? I could swear I had some. Okay, let's turn I back and let's go. Smoked. Normally, I manage to duck out a few times a day, but we've been preoccupied. Where did you last have them? Right here in my pocket, or so I thought. Maybe they fell out when we jumped from the water tower? I suppose. Oh well, I'm probably better off without them. Hello, Laptor. I have a strange feeling that someone is looking for us. Wait, what? So, Laura, I've been meaning to ask you. Why did you? Why don't you do your radio show anymore? Why did you steal the? You had a radio why are you holding show? your cigarettes well, in it your wasn't hand? Really, radio. I'd hack into what? the park intercom and play choice cuts from my record collection. Lately, I haven't had the time. Did you really have to show Artie Bridges how to do it? Believe me, I regret it. But how was I to know how bad he was? He begged me, said it was his dream to be in radio. You know what? He should stick to managing the janitorial group. He is awful. He certainly is. I guess there was a reason it was just a dream. He actually records his show ahead of time so that he can broadcast during work hours. Why would you steal cigarettes and then Did you guys hear that? hold it? Sounded like a rat. Mm-hmm. Dinosaurs aren't the only invasive species InGen brought to the island. There are lots of rats in these tunnels. Maintenance is always setting traps down here. Why would you steal cigarettes and then Do you mind if hold them in for a rest? Hands? My legs are killing me. I suppose we could all use a break. Seriously. Kids, if you're watching, if you're gonna steal, do not hold the, I don't know how the much stolen cigarettes in your hand last. when you you're walking with your father. At the boat. We're staying here until Oscar gets back. We don't but even seriously, know if don't he's alive. Steal. Oscar's fine. He's coming back. And come hell or high water, we are not leaving. T-Rex. Then again, maybe you have a point. Come on, we gotta run! No time! Hide! Damn it. My bad. 
I did not. Uh, uh, what? Oh. Get out of here. Get out of here. Poor dinosaur. Hello. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Damn, that's a. That was a quick time. Like, react or you will die. Why is it so quiet? Oh, sneak. Sneak your raptor. Care for a lysine supplement? No thanks. Well, you know what? Actually, you know what? I, maybe I will. All this running around, my muscles probably need whatever protein I can give them. My thoughts exactly. I haven't gotten this much exercise since Carnival. I guess we've got a lot of extra lysine now that the parasaurs don't need the external supply. Yeah, uh, about that. It's not just the parasaurs. We added the antidote to the main water supply. But that'll reach every dinosaur in the park. The Lysine Contingency Uh that is crazy talk. You're insane! Denying the dinosaurs Lysine was the only safety mechanism we had to keep them out of the global ecosystem. S dude, seriously. It, no, it, it won't do because it's it there's water dinosaurs and, and flying dinosaurs. We've already denied them the right to breed. That's their death sentence. Yes, but who knows how much damage they can do before then? A single brachiosaur can destroy as much jungle in one day as a whole herd of elephants. I can imagine the impact a group of them would have on a rainforest. Ouch. What about there? These animals are now part of the global ecosystem, whether we like it or not. We can't expect them to exist outside of it. There's not an environment on Earth, including this one, that can maintain equilibrium with, with these animals around. Invasive species. It, it doesn't even begin to describe the problem. You're thinking in terms of human lifespans, Jerry. The biosphere is resilient enough to handle one generation of dinosaurs, even if there's a recovery period. A recovery period? Okay. Do I need to remind you that there are 120 miles of ocean between Isla Nublar and the mainland? The Lysine contingency was cruel and unnecessary. What if they can swim? Do you know for a fact that none of these animals can swim? Oh, come on, Jerry. It's how Asian elephants migrated to Sri Lanka from India. There's precedent. You're being ridiculous. There's no evidence sauropods were swimmers. None. You see them in the field every day. Have you ever even seen one of our dinosaurs try to swim? We keep them in cages, Laura. They don't get the chance. I know this. More quadrupeds can swim than can't. All right. I'll concede that it's possible there are sauropods that can swim. But I still believe that 120 miles of open water is an effective barrier. Oh, Jesus. This is like a cat fight. Mm. The remote possibility that a dinosaur could make it to the mainland is far outweighed by our responsibility to treat these animals humanely. They're here because of us. <sighs> and Look, let's just agree to disagree for now. But I'll have to tell InGen when this is all over. I understand. Are you guys done yet? Jess, where'd you go? Just down the hall looking at stuff. Not that you noticed, I was gone. I'm sorry, honey, I was distracted, but don't go off again like that, okay? Yeah, okay. The hell is wrong with you? I know you smoked, but what the hell is wrong with you?
I know that she smoked. Uh oh, quick event. No good. Here comes. Go. Go 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 go. I already clicked. The gate. Chase him. Hello, Raptor. Uh oh. <clears throat> so down and right. My I do apologize. Come on, nice tasty dinosaur. Yeah, look at the Raptor. This. Raptors, uh oh. Ouch. Bye, Raptor. You are a good dinosaur. Rest in peace, dinosaur. Stop eating? Rest in peace, little Raptor. Uh oh. Okay, rest in peace, me. Wait, what? I have to start from here? Come on. Come on. Nice, yeah. tasty dinosaur. I said that the same time. Stay still. Man, I suck at these quick events. Bye, Raptor. Okay. Quick events, quick events. There we go. Now I need to press a lot of Do buttons. Do these things ever stop eating? I don't know. Move. Oh, that parkour though. I know you're about as coordinated as a three-legged mule. I'm coordinated enough to kick you off. Whoa, whoa, easy. I take it back. Damn, you're lucky. You ought to forget our deal and buy a lottery ticket. The embryos. Yeah, yeah, relax. I, uh... I, um... You lost it. You lost it?! It must have fallen out. Come, seriously. Oh, snap. He's being a sneaky. Damn, he's hunting the, the raptor. That's a new one. That's right. Go. Do, 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 do. Can we go upstairs and hunt there? Now there's the place to hide. Okay, I will know that I need to hide there. Last thing I need is for those things to see me better. Okay, cool. Got it. So there's a place to hide right there. Locked. Good. If I can't open it, they can't either. Wait, what? Wait, what? Damn. Okay, seriously, I'm dying more than ever in this episode. Hey, game, I found a bug. So I tried to unlock that and then hide. Locked. Good. If I can't open it, they can't either. Ah, find a bug. A shadow dinosaur. Stab him? Nope. Here they come. Uh, 
There we go. Idiota! Do you know what you've done? Hey! In case you didn't notice, it wasn't exactly a leisurely stroll over here. You dropped it. You find it! Hold your horses. That T-Rex is still out there. T-Rex, where are you? Oh, you're... You're enjoying a meal. Uh, go back and okay, get it. Okay, so we know where it is. Go get it! Yeah, I think I'll wait until our friend there leaves to find a new chew toy. I don't know if we have time. If the embryos go bad, they're worthless. The embryos are worthless to me if I get eaten by a damn lizard. True. If you're not man enough to get the embryos back, I'll do it myself. Hang on. The deal is I hold on to the embryos until we reach your contact. I know. And instead, you drop them. Yeah, well, crap. If you're gonna use logic. Just go. And hurry. Okay. Let's risk our lives for the day of money again. Oops. No, little tiny are eating. Not. Not bad. <laughs> oh. Ah, hello, darling. What brings a nice girl like you to a place like this? Oh, damn it! Uh-oh, uh-oh, run, 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 run. Woo! Oh, my God. <laughs> I got it! Somebody tell Carl Lewis I got some training tips for him! I guess that was, okay, that's great. a football reference. Nice moves out there. Hey, thanks. Almost makes up for dropping it in the first place. Oh, burn. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, let's do one more. Oh. Was not ready for that one. A pressing. Naked la 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 And then you see your raptor. Stop! What? I saw eyes. Who sneaky piranha? Probably a rat or something. Keep moving. No, I saw eyes just like that before I was beaten. I won't go through that again. Big, shiny eyes? You saw them too? Not here, but yeah. Go on. Get out of here. Oh, Epter. Come on, we gotta keep moving. No way! Not until I can see where I'm going. Uh, okay. We can't go back outside because of our old friend Rexy, but uh -oh. maybe we can get the lights on. Uh -oh. It seems like those things, whatever they are, like to stick to the shadows. Uh-oh. Okay. We're in luck. This looks like a power panel right here. Uh-oh. That's as bad for you, dude. You're gonna be seen. 
What's the holdup? It's nothing. It's just a different uh, model than I'm used to, is all. So you're stuck. Shut up. Okay, what is this? What about that thing there? Maybe you have to prime it before turning it on, like an oil pump or something. <laughs> Look, no offense, but this type of electrical system is probably way ahead of anything you've seen before. I got this. Okay, so... Let's Why don't you just read the instructions? They're right there, no? Relax. This thing is just a glorified fuse box. Okay, then, then just press the green button. Push to close. Close what? Well, that was my best guess. All right, I got it now. Close your eyes. You're about to lose your... Okay. Night vision. Oh, it's still a little dark right now. What's going on? Dad? Over here, Jess. It's all right. The backup generator wasn't meant to last this long, that's all. No, that's not it. We should have been fine for days. How the hell was I supposed to know open meant turn everything off? I mean, it's counterintuitive. You would know if you read the instructions. It's true. Why don't you yell a little louder? I think there's a dinosaur on the other side of the island that didn't hear you. Jeez. Whatever. There's a close, right? There's a close, right? <laughs> close that crap right up. There's a close, right? Yeah, that's right. Who's your... Oh, oh, come on. Damn it. Bonnie Bridges, Rocket Jurassic Park's only unofficial radio station. Just a reminder before we sign off, Parklings, if you're not on the boat by 7, you're not going to be on the boat at all. I've got a little something special for all you last-minute packers out there. Personal this is mine, freaky. And I'll see you all on board. Damn it, Artie. He's not still here, is he? No. From the sound of it, he queued up this last bit of tape and took off. So here's a little something to get you ready to set sail. Okay. Cheer up. Wait, what? Damn, I'm doing good so far. He's calling for help. At least we're rocking to a jam. Or when doing this. Oh, Matrix. Wait, ma Matrix, not Matrix. Oops, my bad. That was a good opportunity to stab him. Wait, what? I made all of those right choices and I die if I make a one mistake? Jesus. Game, you, why are you so hard? Mother of God, I did it. Oscar. Three more. That way. Damn. He's a god. Artie, this show is over. Laura, you are my new favorite person. You've forgiven me for fixing the lysine problem? Don't push it. Holy crap, Oscar. Did you just take one of those things out by hand? Look who woke up. Why are you here? I see Sleeping Beauty woke up. Did you have to kiss her? I woke up just fine on my own, <laughs> thanks. Right? You were in that tree the whole time. Of course I was. Hey, listen. When I kiss you, you'll remember it. That's never gonna happen. Oh, don't be like that. Don't push it. You're supposed to be at the crash site. Yeah, uh, the plan didn't factor in an angry T-Rex, so we had to change it. 
I didn't think to engage it in a knife fight, sorry. We had to change the plan. That's right. I unlocked the mystery behind the shaving cream can. Turns out, little Miss Sunshine here is smuggling dino embryos off the island. What? I know that look. Let me guess. You have a plan. Yeah, well, turns out these things are worth a lot of money to the right people. I mean, a lot. Hypocrite, you gonna do it? You going along with her? Hey, I'm not doing anything unless you're down. But come on, Oscar. Do you really think InGen gives a rat's ass about us? Look what happened to B-Team, to Decaf. Their families are gonna get a puny check, a gag order, and nothing else. Hypocrite. Uh, well, hypocrite. You're pretty self-righteous for a thief. I wouldn't be a thief if you hadn't stolen this island from my people in the first place. I didn't steal anything. The Costa Rican government rented this place to InGen. And you did their dirty work, didn't you? I did my job. Just like I'm doing now. Really? And how many people are you going to kill today? You shut the hell up, or I'll start counting with you. Whoa, whoa, no fighting. Save it for the dinos, huh? Do I gotta remind you we're working against the clock? There's no time to save these people and be her errand boys before this place turns to ground zero. What do you mean ground zero? Nothing. We could do it, Oscar. We've got a call for another helicopter anyway, so one of us takes the eggheads back to the mainland and the other takes her to meet her Hey, contact. got it. Understood. Let me guess. That last part would be up to you. You just tell Injian that I bought it like the rest of the guys they sent. Then you and I hook up later to split our cut. I trust you, but I don't trust her. Okay, so before I explain or choose any of these, I'm gonna explain to you if you don't understand. So these guys were sent to save the rest of the people out in the island, and um, they did it because the InGen or someone is gonna blow this whole island up. So they need to evacuate immediately. Uh, I'll think about it. I don't know, Billy. InGen throws a lot of work our way. Not sure I want to burn that bridge. I understand, but we're talking about a retirement level payout here. Look, you don't have to decide now. Plenty of time before we call for another chopper. All right, let's move out. Take it slow and quiet. Just go. Tip quiet. Quiet time. Let's not start this again. I respect your opinion, Jerry. Although, to Wait, be what? honest, I'm a little surprised at your lack of regard for the animals. It's not that I don't care about them, Laura. It's just there are so many unintended consequences that come with How can decision. you not smell cigarettes on your daughter? We can't keep this a secret, Laura. Shoot. We need contingency plans. We'll need to monitor things outside of the park. Where is it? I know it. <laughs> yes. I can smell a mile away when you're smoking. Yes, <laughs> you know. Jesse? Rip. So yeah, I'm gonna end the episode here, and next time we're gonna continue on with a quick event, and hopefully I'm not gonna die five more times, just like in this episode. Hope you enjoyed it, give it a like, subscribe, and now the outro, and I uh, sorry for not putting a video yesterday, I was kind of more of a sick than I am today. So, bye bye, love you all. See you guys later, and have a nice day. Let's put a smile on that face.